How come there's no Janet Helm singing back up behind the ABBA? She wasn't invited to travel to Sweden to perform background vocals in the studio, with her friends Belinda West, Bruce Dees, the Holiday Sisters, with members Ginger and Mary, and Lee Jane Brinati, behind that Swedish pop quartet, because she had no extra money. Instead, she was asked to sing backup, only for American country singer, guitarist and musician, Larry John Wilson, on his two albums, New Beginnings, and, Let Me Sing My Song To You. Before she became a session background vocalist behind Larry John Wilson on his same two albums, she was in a gospel group, the Augusta College Choir, performing All My Trials, with her friend, Tommy Whitaker, taken from their only one album. Voices from White Columns, released in 1965, and then her only one solo single, So Many Ways to Die, written by Rupert Holmes, and Paul Vance, released five years later on the Avco Embassy record label. After her last session background vocal work with Larry John Wilson on his second album, Let Me Sing My Song to You, in 1977, she retired from the music industry that's short-lived and faded into obscurity.